Welcome to UTech. Before you decide which next-gen TV to buy, you need to understand the massive shift that's happening in display technology right now. Samsung has just revealed its micro RGB technology, while other brands are pushing RGB mini LED panels to new limits. But what's the real difference? Which one delivers better brightness, contrast, and long-term value? Hit that like button, subscribe to join the UTech family, and ring the bell. Today we're breaking it all down, pixel by pixel, so you know exactly what you're paying for before you upgrade. What is RGB Mini LED? RGB Mini LED is the evolution of traditional Mini LED technology. Instead of relying on white backlights filtered through color layers, RGB Mini LEDs use separate red, green, and blue emitters for every zone. This means truer color output, improved contrast control, and better energy efficiency. Imagine thousands of tiny RGB diodes lighting up your screen, working independently to produce deeper blacks and brighter highlights. This setup significantly reduces blooming, that halo effect around bright objects on dark scenes, and allows for higher HDR precision. Brands like TCL, Hisense and BOE are already experimenting with this tech, claiming it brings OLED-like color depth but with much higher brightness levels and better lifespan. What is Samsung Micro RGB? Now, Samsung's Micro RGB takes things one giant leap further. Instead of using backlights and filters, each pixel is an independent RGB micro LED, meaning every pixel emits its own light and color, similar to OLED but without the organic material that can degrade over time. The result? Insane brightness, pure contrast, and pixel-level color accuracy. Micro RGB panels can hit over 5,000 nits of peak brightness while maintaining near-perfect black levels. They're also more energy-efficient and immune to burn-in issues that affect OLED displays. In short, Samsung's Micro RGB isn't just an improvement, it's a potential replacement for both OLED and Mini-LED in the future. Brightness and HDR performance. When it comes to brightness, RGB Mini-LED TVs already outperform OLEDs by a huge margin, often reaching between 1,500 to 2,000 nits of peak brightness. But Samsung's Micro RGB takes it even further. Some prototypes are reported to hit 5,000 to 10,000 nits. That means HDR content, especially bright highlights like sunlight, reflections, or explosions, looks dramatically more realistic. The dynamic range is far superior, creating a cinema-like experience even in brightly lit rooms. However, Micro RGB's extreme brightness can also expose imperfections in tone mapping if not calibrated well, so performance will depend heavily on how Samsung tunes its image processing. Contrast and Black Levels Here's where Micro RGB dominates. Since every pixel emits its own light, black levels are truly black, with zero light bleed. RGB Mini LED, while impressive, still uses local dimming zones, so you'll occasionally see minor blooming in high-contrast scenes. However, RGB Mini LED TVs have made huge strides, with thousands of dimming zones, some models come surprisingly close to pixel-level control. So unless you're watching in a pitch-dark room, the difference might be subtle to most viewers. Color Accuracy and Viewing Angles Both technologies offer incredible color precision, but Micro RGB again has the upper hand. With direct RGB light emission, it covers nearly 100% of Rec.2020 color space, something OLED and Mini LED still struggle to achieve. RGB Mini LED though, provides very natural tones with excellent DCI-P3 coverage, making it fantastic for movies and HDR gaming. But viewing angles can slightly narrow because of the LCD structure behind the Mini LED layer. Micro RGB's self-emissive pixels mean consistent colors and brightness from every angle, no matter where you sit in the room. Gaming Performance For gamers, both technologies are next level. RGB Mini LED TVs already support 120Hz or 144Hz refresh rates, ultra-low input lag, and full HDMI 2.1 features. But Samsung Micro RGB might redefine gaming visuals completely. With faster pixel response times and unmatched HDR brightness, games will look sharper, more fluid, and more immersive. Imagine ray-traced lighting on a display that actually matches real-world brightness. That's what Micro RGB aims to deliver. However, early Micro RGB panels may be extremely expensive, so RGB Mini LED will likely remain the best value option for gamers through 2025 to 2026. Lifespan and Burn-In Resistance 
Micro RGB has a clear advantage here. Because it's based on inorganic LEDs, it's highly durable and resists burn-in, a big win over OLED. RGB Mini LED is also very reliable, with a long lifespan and minimal degradation, but it still uses LCD layers, which may slowly lose brightness over years of use. If you're thinking long-term, Micro RGB is built for endurance, while Mini LED remains a solid, proven option for longevity with lower cost. Price and Availability Now let's talk about money, because this is where things get real. RGB Mini LED TVs are already widely available and relatively affordable compared to OLEDs. Models like TCL QM8, Hisense U8N, and Samsung QN90D give you top-tier performance under a reasonable budget. Micro RGB TVs, on the other hand, are still in early stages. Samsung's first models are expected to launch at ultra-premium prices, likely targeting enthusiasts and professionals first. Over time, as production scales up, prices will fall, but expect these to remain flagship only for the next few years. The Future of TV Displays So, what does the future hold? RGB Mini LED will dominate the mid-range and upper mid-range market, balancing performance, price, and availability. It's bright, reliable, and already close to OLED in quality. Samsung's Micro RGB, though, is the real next-gen leap, the kind of tech that could completely replace OLED and Mini LED in high-end TVs within the next decade. If you're upgrading soon, go for a top Mini LED model now, but keep an eye on Micro RGB in 2026 and beyond, because that's where the future of display technology truly begins. And that's the full breakdown of RGB Mini LED versus Samsung Micro RGB, two technologies that are shaping the next generation of TVs. Which one impressed you more? Let me know in the comments. Don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and tap the bell icon for more daily TV tech updates, comparisons, and leaks, only here on UTech.